the April 1st, 1933, the Nazi government declared a boycott against all Jewish businesses and professions. And uh, that was the beginning of economic pressure. Uh, in April, there were laws excluding Jews uh, or putting a very strict quota on Jews in the universities, in the high schools, um, excluding Jews from the civil service, from the teaching professions, from uh, many legal, pro from legal professions, from medical professions, unless the Jews had been in that profession because young people in particular could no longer have careers or futures. The German Jewish community did an enormously uh, wonderful job in getting about 80% of its youth out of Germany. Even said hello to them, they lost their jobs. And then we move quickly toward um, the pogrom of November 1938, which was the first time Jews as Jews were targeted and beaten, and 32,000 men were put in concentration camps, the synagogues were burned. After that, everybody who could tried desperately to get out. But they couldn't get an exit visa until someone had come from the um, administration to look at all of their property, to make sure that their property was carefully listed, to tax them on their property, and then slowly, slowly to let them go.